Hey family, welcome back. Today we are making a type of Kenyan dawa, kamo kona homa, sore throat, or just looking for a refreshing beverage, this one is for you. Now, there are a million ways of making it, but I'll show you how I make mine. Stay tuned. Winfrey's Kitchen. To make dawa, we will need cloves. Cloves are rich in antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties that help boost immunity also helps in improving digestion. We'll also need cinnamon. Cinnamon regulates blood sugar, gives you antioxidants in your body. It can also help fight cancer. We also need ginger. Ginger aids in digestion. It's an antibacterial and antifungal, and it also helps in circulation of the body. We'll also need lemons. Lemons help in lowering blood sugar levels, aids in digestion, supports weight loss and promotes hydration. And lastly, we'll need honey. Honey has anti-inflammatory and antibiotic properties. It reduces cough. It's also great for gut health. So first I'm going to grate the ginger. I'm going to grate the ginger with the skin on. Next, I'm going to squeeze in the lemon juice. I'm doing this to release more juice. I'm cutting this into half. Now I'm going to simmer all my ingredients. And I'll start with cloves and cinnamon. If you have, have the back of the cinnamon, you can also use it as well. I didn't have it, so that's why I used the powdered one. I'm stirring so that the cinnamon and the cloves can infuse properly with the water. Next, I'll add my lemon juice. Then I'll add my ginger. I'll allow this to simmer. I'll then cover it and let it simmer till it boils. And our dawa is ready. So I am going to save it. Once you're done with making your dawa, do not throw this residue away. You can use it to make another dawa or you can add it in in your smoothies. So now I'm going to stir and then I'll add honey. Now I'm going to add one teaspoon of honey, but you can add uh, the teaspoons you prefer. Lastly, I'll garnish it with some lemon. And it's ready to drink. If you like this recipe, let me know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like the video, share and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode of Winfrey's Kitchen. Follow for more.